Okay, everybody, good afternoon. It's time now for a 4K update for June 17th, 2023, and I got one 4K steelbook in the mail from BestBuy.com today, and I will also be updating you on one of the Blu-rays I got a, a while ago uh, because there was a problem with it that I recently solved. But before we do that, let's go get to the actual update itself. So we're gonna start off with a new. We're gonna be. We're gonna be showing you a new release that is technically not even out until Tuesday, but I got it in today, three days before it comes out. And this is the 2023 4K Steelbook for. If I could position it properly, this is Avatar: of A Way of Water, which is a 2022 movie. And let me pull this out, which stars. Sam Worthington, Zoe Zaldana, Sigourney Weaver, Stephen Lang, and Kate Winslet. And, of course, this is the long-awaited sequel to Avatar, directed by James Cameron. And um, this was a long time coming. It took over 12 years, I believe, to, for this movie to get made, to be released. I'm pretty sure it's 12 years, maybe 13 years. But, finally, we have the film now on home media. And I'm going to be showing you the back of this thing first before I go into the actual steel book because it actually has all the stuff information on the back here. Beyond Dazzling said by Owen Gleiberman of Variety. And this three disc set contains over three hours of bonus features. This one is the 4K Ultra HD version of the movie. This two is the Blu-ray version of the movie. And this three is the Blu-ray bonus features, including the new characters of Pandora, meet the important new characters of the Avatar Saga, played by Kate Winslet, Cliff Curtis, Edie Falco, Brendan Cowell, and Jermaine Clement, the challenges of Pandora's waters, James Cameron tackles the non-trivial challenge of performance capture above and below the water's surface, Bringing Pandora to life, Weta FX takes over with unpre unprecedented advancements in facial performance and making CGI water look real. Pandora's returning characters, James Cameron reunites with his returning cast, Sam Worthington, Zoe Zaldana, uh, Stephen Lang, and Sigourney Weaver. To get, together they discuss the amazing evolution of their characters and so much more. Rated PG-13 for... Sequences of strong violence and intense action, partial nudity, and some strong language, and it's 192 minutes, which is 3 hours and 12 minutes, and it's co-produced once again by Lightstorm Entertainment, and this is the first 20th Century Studios movie that I have in my 4K, in my entire movie collection. I mean, I have a lot of Fox titles on 4K, but not anything from the 20th Century Studios rebrand until today. And now I'm going to show you the actual steelbook itself, which has fantastic artwork. There it is right there. Really, really nice. Let's open this up. Whoops, this fell out. Here is the... 4K Ultra HD disc, which contains just the movie, and it does have artwork, shockingly, for a um, Disney title, even though most of Disney's 4K titles do have artwork, but the Blu-rays don't, but this is one of the cases where that's not the case, and all the discs have artwork. Here is the Blu-ray version of the movie, the regular Blu-ray, which again has artwork. I don't know if you can see that, but let me just... Focus in on it more. And here is the Blu-ray bonus features disc with some concept art. And once you take it all out, I'm going to attempt to take this all out. I only have a couple of fingers here. Okay, come on. Let me just put this... Uh, on my ring finger. Whoops, I don't want to touch it. Anyway, uh, let me just position the camera. Here is the inside artwork, which is, of course, taken from the sequence with the whale. Let me just put all these discs back. Whoa. 
Sorry. The one of this got dusty. Come on. There we go. No, no, no. Wrong way. All right. Just make sure it's in there properly. There we go. There it's better. Um, I did see this movie in theaters, obviously. I uh, Almost everybody did. Oh, let me took the... And I forgot to tell you, show you the digital HD code, which I already have put in. You can't take this. Because it's already been entered. Anyway, I did see this movie in the theater the day after it released. In 3D. And this was a fantastic follow-up to the original Avatar. I don't know if it is as good as the original Avatar. I'm going to need to rewatch it. And actually, I'm planning on watching this after... Watching this 4K after I'm done making this video. So, but... This is still a phenomenal sequel to the movie, to the original Avatar, and in some ways it is better than the original. Some ways I do prefer the original, but this is still absolutely fantastic. This was worth the 12 year wait. I highly, highly recommend it if you haven't seen it. Although I'm pretty sure everybody has seen it because uh, it's the third highest grossing film of all time. So if you haven't seen it, you're kind of living under a rock. But definitely check this out. This Best Buy Steelbook is awesome. If you could get it while you can, it's worth buying and now i'm going to do a little bit of an update on one of the discs that i have in particular the clerks 2 blu-ray that i have um i got this in october during prime day well the disc the the blu-ray on prime day however when i watch when i attempted to watch the film about a month ago maybe two months ago with the lionsgate pressing it did not, disc one did not want to load at all. I'm serious. Disc one did not load at all. It was an error code. Disc two worked fine, but disc one did not work at all. So I was like, I was kind of pissed off. So um, two months later, I got another copy of this uh, uh, Blu-ray. This is not my original copy. And this time, this is the original Weinstein Company Blu-ray distributed by Genius Products LLC. You could tell there's a little bit of it. If you could compare and contrast the two covers, there is a little bit of a difference. And I did test this out when I got this on eBay last week, last Saturday, actually. Um, and this one actually does work. So I'm going to be keeping this one. I already threw my Lionsgate pressing in the trash because even if I tried to sell it, it doesn't fucking work. What's the point of it? I'm, I just threw it in the trash. But, yeah, I'm glad I have a, a copy of Clerks 2 that actually does work. So, happy about that. So, that's. I just wanted to give you an update about that. And there's my 4K update for June 17th, 2023. And thanks for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button. Hit on the subscribe button. Click the post notification bell. And I will see you guys next time.